Now, as the possibility has increased that the U.S. might uh, tip into recession this year, is a good time to buy U.S. equities or not? Joining us with a view is Professor David Costa, Dean at the Robert Kennedy College. David, good to see you. We had a guest on earlier today on Worldwide Exchange said actually, um, predicated on what the dollar m might do if it, can, if it can hold up, he would actually be looking at U.S. equities a little later in the year. What's your view? Uh, hello, Ross. Well, it much depends. It's very difficult to say. However, um, for what I have seen so far, uh, I would still tend to be cautious on uh, U.S. equities. Uh, we have seen a very slow start of 2008, and uh, we have seen a rally on uh, commodities. So uh, you have to look around and see on your portfolio whether it's probably time to spice it up or diversify. And I think that's a really an excellent time to change your portfolio uh, in view of being a bit more defensive. What... Um Besides, the, when you say defensive, you're talking traditional sort of defensive, consumer staple, food companies, that sort of thing. Uh, yes, but not only. I would also tend to, to look directly into the commodities which are, are probably on the rise at the moment. Uh, uh, a lot of agricultural commodities are now uh, pretty much undervalued and they've already started a 2008 rally. So there are a lot of financial instruments now to invest directly into commodities. So it's very good to look at equities, but at the same time, I would try to diversify in the portfolio, look what commodities are doing, if there is any way to buy commodities directly via an exchange trader commodity fund or something without too many overheads, and, uh, and go also in, the, in a more defensive strategy, because when, when the, the equities are so depressed like they are at the moment, the commodities tend to rise up, and this already happened at the beginning of 2008. It might be that uh, equities have a, have a possibility to, go, to come back uh, on the second quarter of 2008, and so in this case, if that is your strategy is very good to buy now at a bargain price and resell later. However, if you want to play defensive and take care of your portfolio in a defensive way, probably buying commodity is the right thing to do at this stage. Yeah, and would that include gold? Uh, we had Ross Norman on a little bit earlier, who's incredibly bullish. He would be. He's from the, the bullion desk. Um, would you be buying gold at these levels? Yes, gold, it's, it's certainly uh, influenced not only by demand and supply, like usually commodities are, but also by a lot of mystique and by a lot of uh, uh, particular situation like now where uh, um, central banks are, are, are cutting rates and they're probably buying more gold. And India is one of the biggest consumers of gold and uh, we have seen an increase in India, uh, an increase also in jewelry, gold use for jewelry, but also as a, as a refuge. So gold is certainly on the, on the top list of commodities to buy. Uh, however, I wouldn't disregard all the commodities uh, like agricultural commodities. For example, we have seen already a rally on wheat, but uh, there are other possibilities in the commodity space. So gold, it's, it's certainly uh, on the top list, but it doesn't have to be the only one.